Hey guys! Well, today I decided to make an extra video for you. One week of Miss Universe has already passed, and after a very slow process, we finally could see the official pictures of the delegates. And I felt that I had to make this video because all I have to say about those pictures is like WTF. Seriously, what happened to this picture? I hate referring to them this way, but first, the process took longer than usual. And second, I can't see any concept on those portraits. They go from body painting, posing by the pool, against some wall, some are in color, some in black and white, and topless? What happened with that? After all the buzz about the topless pictures, just a couple of them were actually topless, like Trinidad and Tobago in Japan and USA. And not to mention that we barely see some of the girls in those shots. Overall, I'm just not impressed by these glam shots, but I'm glad they're off. But thanks to the shots, now we can talk about some of the performers of the girls. During this week, I believe that it's Ireland who still dominated the competition. I think her image impacts on every single shot she's in. And as of today, I don't think she has any competition or anybody that close to her. But there are also girls who were improving this week, and some of them caught my eye. One of them is Miss Peru. I think she's very sassy, sexy, and very photogenic. I think she also has a great potential to make it to the semi-finals. Miss Colombia also has stayed very strong from the beginning. She's a very simple beauty, but also very attractive. There's something interesting about her. Also, Miss Haiti, Miss Dominican Republic, and Miss Greece are three of the ones that brought attention to me this week. Also, remember that you can stay updated with everything that's happening in Miss University 2010 on my blog, the JLU blog, so go visit it. And this is everything I have for this special video. Thank you for watching and see you guys on Tuesday.